If you are here to hear me just speak without smacking, licking my fingers, ashy hands, um, anything that's not ratchet, you in the wrong place. Go to the next video. Get it. Enjoy the video. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nikki, the host. And today I'm back with another mukbang video. <laughs> we on a roll. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell y'all leave. So, listen, y'all. First of all, Shout out to y'all for tuning into my videos. My hands are ashy today. I don't care. Uh, but shout out to y'all for tuning into my videos, man, because, you know, it's time for something new. Yeah. It's time for something new, baby. That's what I got. I got some, uh, some Hennessy wings. I need a thumbnail, of course, but... You always got to get the, the corny smell on the shit. <clears throat> Let's say our grace. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna have to switch it up, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna have to switch it up. But we're gonna do, <laughs> we're gonna do the same one for now. God is great and God is good. Let us take it for our food by as we all be fed. Give us Lord our daily bread. Amen. Thank you, God. So, first of all, I'm hot. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut that one off. We're gonna, yeah. Yeah, because I'm hot, yeah. I need that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So today, um, I got a story time. What was I? <laughs> I always forget. I just had me a little shot of Johnny Walker. Okay. I'm doing Uber. For those who don't know, uh, for a while I didn't go outside. When I say I didn't go outside, I wasn't going nowhere. I wasn't going to nobody's event. Nobody's. Mm. Um, not homemade rent. But it's good. I wasn't... I wasn't going to nobody's event. I wasn't going to nobody's nothing. Okay? Um, I was just in the house. And... Here recently... I've been getting the urge... To want to go outside. So... I told y'all, if I go outside... I'm going to get paid while I'm outside. Shout out to my editor, Dan. Okay, he takes care of my videos that I need to edit while I'm outside. And all I got to do is focus on me and outside. <laughs> so, I got to get paid while doing so. Get it. Anybody that can talk shit about a person doing Uber, saying whatever you want to say, feel free. $200 a day. Damn near. Not a bad day for me. <laughs> anyway. So. I know what I had to do. I had to tell y'all a story time. About this girl. We had to rescue. To get home. Let me indulge in this, this Hennessy wing now. Give me a second. Mm. They, they could have been cooked hard. The TZ would have had a fit. <laughs> no doubt. They good though. I'll thug it. So. Mm. It was 4th of July weekend. We was having a great time. We was lit as hell, okay? And when I say lit, lit. Drunk. And just high of life. We was having a real good time. And we was at the apartment complex. Complex that they at. A lot of people live there. Like, 
several YouTubers, a couple of celebrities. <laughs> I gotta pour up my cup for this one. I gotta pour up my cup for this one. Mini ha, let's go! One. It's been a long time coming Ha, how can I forget? I can never lose what a bitch thought Cause I'm the queen of this shit Fuck a friend, this shit irrelevant If you got beef, better settle Cause it. bitch, my bag is up and I don't give a fuck And I'm the wrong nigga to be played with Friend of my enemy No, I can't fuck with no enemies You are stealing my energy Damn, I thought you was a friend of me You know couple influencers live there so it's a building where a lot of people be at so we was at the we decided to walk up towards the street to go look at the fireworks and this girl had walked by she was alone she was in a bathing suit mm. Alone in a bathing suit. She looked lost and drunk as hell, right? So she walked by once. We didn't pay her no attention. She walked by again. We was like, I think it was me. I'm like, yo, you all right? Or one of them. Are you alright? So she got to spilling her tea like, no, I'm not alright. <laughs> I'm drunk. I came here with such and such. But I had my phone. Somebody done took my phone. We like, what the fuck happened? We knew we was gonna get her home. You know, out here in Atlanta or anywhere you are. ST is, is very prevalent these days. And they looking for us. Chocolate or black, butter pecan, light skin, purple. Y'all don't come with me on the colorism. They looking for us. And ready to snatch our asses up. So, I'm like, no ma'am. No ma'am, that's not what we doing. Who did you come here with? Well, I came here with blah, blah, blah. She was coherent enough to say who she came here with who her sister was, what her number was, where she lived. Because she was so drunk, we didn't know if she got roofied or not. We was just trying to make sure that, you know, she didn't need any medical attention. But she didn't. She knew what was going on. She just didn't know what her belongings were. So, it's getting later. We getting a little bit out of her, but not enough. Hit her sister up. Sister answer. Sorry. We know where you live. We gonna call the maintenance man. Cause you know, at our apartment complex, you have an emergency number you can call for the maintenance man. So we like, we gonna call your maintenance man and we gonna have him let you in. And we ain't leaving until he lets you in and you lock your door. Can't trust the maintenance man either. Yeah. So, literally, I'm ready. Y'all hop in the car. We about to go to her house. So, I believe we was on the way to her house, and her friends ended up calling one of us. 
And girl, they broke out crying. Do you hear me? I'm talking about falling. Balling crying. She was actually afraid for us to call her sister because she said she didn't want her sister to tell her basically to to talk shit about what she was doing. Because this wasn't her first time getting drunk and doing this shit. So we like... We don't give a damn about none of that. <laughs> I need you to find your people. But anyway, her friends hit us back. From her phone. They had her phone. They hit us back from her phone. And they was like, hello? Yep. Do you have such a site? Mm-hmm. I say, we trying to find y'all. Girl, she bust out crying. She was like, oh my God. Mm. Thank you so much. Like, one of the girls said, and her cousin or sister or something had recently went missing because of a situation like this and I don't think that they had found her at that moment and it's a scary thing to just be out drinking thinking you having a good time and you end up being lost you know what I'm saying? You you lose your people. Or somebody done drugged you and snatched your ass up. It's a real fucking thing. Bars are involved. Hotels are involved. That's why I always try my best to watch where the fuck I'm at and what I'm doing. And y'all need to too, man. If I see a woman in need, I'm helping. If I see a woman who don't know where the hell she at, I'm asking. Do you know where the hell you at, friend? And if she don't, we're going to figure it out. And if her master pull up, he ain't pulling off with her. Mm -mm. This some shit you will die about, boy. But I'm gonna tell you right now, I believe in good karma. Every time I find a phone, I find a person to take their phone back. Because if I leave mine, I need you to bring me my phone back, friend. I need my phone. You know what I'm saying? And. Every time I leave my phone, I might bring my phone back. So I feel like it's some type of good karma in this universe. So I pray anything happen to me unknowingly, unbeknownst to me, somebody bring me back. For real. That shit ain't no joke. So... We got her back to her friends and they was like, thank you so much. We just got lost. We didn't know where the hell she was at. We've been looking for her for the past. Yeah, I gotta make sure behind me. We've been looking for her 
uh, for the past hour. Julie is so happy that she didn't get, you know, kidnapped. So I'm not trying to make y'all sad or nothing. I just, you know, you got to be safe. Um, mm -mm. I'm the one. Yeah. Mm. Had another person I was. Mm. Mm -mm. Had another person I caught myself being cool with. We went out one night. And we in the car shooting shit in his van pull up. A guy. He looking, looking like a nigga was scouting. All he needed was some goggles. You know what I'm saying? She ain't say nothing to nobody. One thing, no matter what happened with between me and her, she's a protector. Um, she cared about people. Um, that nigga was scouting girls and shit. She said, "Yo, nigga, what the fuck you doing?" <laughs> <laughs> nigga, what the fuck? You doing? I forgot what he said. But it was enough for her to take that bottle of douce we had. <laughs> and she broke his whole van window. I feel like she said, nigga, what? Nigga, get your ass from my uh, uh, uh. That nigga is... <laughs> that nigga drove off and went and checked the van. Anybody else would have checked that van right then and there. Like, bitch, did you just fucking hit my van? Because we didn't drive off. She was waiting like, <laughs> nigga, what's up, nigga? He's good. Nigga went checking the van and shit. She was like, not today. That's not what you're doing out in front of me. Girl. And I'm telling y'all, that nigga was scared as hell. They prey on weak women. They prey on women that have weak spots. You know? And it's sad. But I don't even want to continue talking about that shit. We got it to the crib safe. And I'm just happy she okay. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully she's still okay today. Can't save everybody and can't save them every time, but if I can save you in a moment. I win. She was just walking around looking lost. Like, I don't know where the hell I am. And I'm scared as hell. You know, that's sad. Especially with, with alcohol being involved out here.
Everybody gonna be outside for the summer. This year is an outside year. I ate three wings because I'm gonna go with these hoes in the air fryer. But this year, this summer is the go outside summer. Oh, that shit was busting. This is the the go outside summer, okay? For everybody. So don't get caught up in the bullshit. Why y'all outside drinking on this alcohol and all that? This soda water, y'all. Maybe it's not soda water. That was disgusting. Anyway, I gotta go get some water for my ass. My ass to reflux be like, bitch, what's up? <laughs> But listen, y'all. Uh, uh, Make sure you watch out for yourselves. Watch out for your loved ones. Watch out for your sisters. And watch out for everybody, bro. Um, it's going to be one of them summers. <clears throat> that I feel like going to make or break anybody. You know what I'm saying? So That's all I want to say. But I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Hope y'all enjoying these mukbangs. Let me put this in the beginning, Nick. But all right, y'all. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. I'll see y'all in the next video. Hey, hey.